Monday classes is to come in through the hall and see what we've been doing for Step Week. I'm trying to find out which car makes, which ramp makes the car go the fastest. We've got a science fair in the hall today, and I'm we're showing everyone our, our experiment. The experiment that we've been doing today is the walking water experiment. First, you put water in. Then you put kitchen roll in the blue and yellow jars to make green. The water it absorbs it and it's supposed to make green. Our experiment is where we have to build a sweet and then cocktail sticks and see how strong the structure is. Well people are coming to try and make their own and then they're seeing how strong they are. We're just putting a little bit of weight on and then if they can handle it, then they can. And we've made um, like stuff out of marshmallows as well and really big long sets. So today we've been doing a height and jump, jump experiment. Because we're seeing if um, taller people can jump further than littler people. Um, well, in the other class, they they did, but in our class they didn't. Because sometimes, if they're heavier maybe, or if they're um, bigger, they might not be able to jump as far. We've been doing the ice into water experiment, and what we've been doing is we've been asking people, what do you think will melt the fastest? The pillow, the blanket, the radiator, the plastic bag, and many other things. And a lot of people said the radiator, but the actual one was the plastic bag, because all the heat is in the plastic bag, and all the cold air can't get in. Our experiment was we had to get these ice cubes, and we had Coca-Cola, milk, blue, green, yellow, and red, and we had to time them and see which one was the strongest. I um, estimated that the Coca-Cola one would win because of all the sugar and all the ingredients in it and the Coca-Cola did win because of all the sugar in it. We've been telling your fives and your threes everything about it and the, um, we also did another project and we had the hot water and we had to put different materials finding the best insulator and the foil one because if you look at it you can see yourself and so that's reflected in the back to so in year six we have been doing an experiment about does your height affect your lung capacity and how big it is. So what we've done, we, we, we got a bottle and labelled it every 250 millilitres and we put a hose in it and filled it up with water. So then if you blow in, if you tip it upside down and blow into it with the hose then and, and the, you have to take a big breath and then every like line there's gone then that's how many you count so for example say it was five then you put five times 250 divided by a thousand and then you'd put it as your total and whatever the answer is that's having your lung capacity is.